Let's balance the equation for the decomposition of ammonia. That's NH3, and it decomposes into N2 and H2, nitrogen gas and hydrogen gas. This decomposition reaction happens at high temperatures and in the presence of a catalyst, something like platinum catalysts or maybe nickel. So let's balance the equation. Count the atoms up on both sides. We have one nitrogen and three hydrogens in the reactants. In the products, we have the two nitrogens and the two hydrogen atoms. Probably a good idea to get this hydrogen to an even number. We can do that by putting a 2 in front of the NH3. This 2, it goes to everything. So we have 3 times 2. That'll give us 6. Now we have an even number. And 1 times 2, that gives us 2 nitrogens. It actually balances the nitrogens. Looks like all we need to do is put a coefficient of 3 in front of the H2. 2 times 3, that gives us 6. We're done. This equation is balanced. So really the trick here is we had that odd number, that 3. We just put a coefficient of 2 in front of the ammonia, and that doubled that. Seemed to solve our problems. If you want to write the states, they look like this. And again, you would need to do this at high temperatures and have a catalyst to make this reaction really go forward. This is Dr. B with the decomposition of ammonia, NH3. Thanks for watching.